What's up, y'all? It's Reflection D. And Chef Ebony Ross. We are here for another reaction video from ECX <laughs> Natalie. It's the Gorilla Glue prank on girl friend. You got that girl and that friend split apart. I don't know. It's going wrong, okay? Anything related to Gorilla Glue, as we know now in the news, is always going wrong. So, um, we're what just going to watch. <laughs> I know I'm not making fun of that girl. I have my own opinion about it. I mean, I'm not making fun of nobody, but everybody know anything related to Gorilla Glue these days. Super glue. Yeah, I saw another prank about by another YouTuber about the gorilla glue, and I was like, "Did you see the girl who put real that? gorilla glue in her hair?" Yeah. I saw that. And it was like melting her hair. You talking about a different girl, not the original girl? No, no, no. Because no. that girl didn't show putting gorilla glue in her hair. She didn't show it. This girl actually put the gorilla glue in her hair, and it was melting away as she did it. Are right, you ready to get started? What do you think gonna happen? So as you see, first of all, let me look, just say, look, Natalie's Natalie's actually doing. Natalie's her probably hair. taking Easy's hair down. I mean, because I don't know what she put in the grill glue on. She got braids, so right. She's maybe some moisturizer, maybe moisture or correct conditioning. Like I don't know, but I'm gonna just say you. I love the idea that I can't wait to see this. I don't know. We've never seen this yet. But and, Natalie yeah. like legitimately just incorporates pranks into their actual day, and that is genius because it doesn't take a bunch of planning. Because you already know what you're going to do that day. You know what you're going to do that day. So you just throw a prank in here, throw a prank in there. It's one of the reasons why I love them so much. I think it's just genius how effortlessly they blend their real lives with, with, the, with YouTube the YouTube world. Yeah. So, and you know, like we have videos like that. I don't know if you guys, we got a couple of videos. We have a lot of actually actual videos at archive but we have some videos out now where she's actually doing my hair or mm -hmm. you know more like doing something to my hair in the process of doing something because that's that's the unique part about you know having multiple streams of income you can mm -hmm. be doing i mean she could you know just like when people get paid to do hair and then they're showing a video of it those are typically two streams of income so one's paying you and then somebody's paying somebody's the more you watch the video, the more you get paid. So I think it's, it's pretty cool. It's unique. I mean, this is the what you know, Easy talked about before about it being 24 hours in a day and what you can do in a day. I always said that. So we all have the same 24 hours in a day. True. People who say, I don't have time. I can't, I can't, I can't. The people that you look up to, that you're inspired are, by. You know, doing great motivational philanthropist things, all these amazing things. They got, we got the same day. So <laughs> we got to just make better choices with our time. But anyways, that, that's right. That's self discipline. Yeah. All, that. All right, you're ready to take a look? I got to show them my painting when I'm done. I can't stop staring at it. It is so beautiful. You want to show them now? No, I'll show them at the end. Okay. It's beautiful. I painted all of these. All the ones you know. You guys check out the Valentine's Day video, the part one video, where I show you, all, you guys all the paintings that I painted. I painted a bunch of paintings. She show. didn't paint this stuff. I painted this. And she was talking about our. Valentine's Day video. She's not talking about somebody else's, but all the stuff oh, I painted. Sorry. What first I of all, you said check out the Valentine's Day stuff. But I'm since sorry. Valentine's right. Day, I yeah. still painted five more, like since Valentine's Day, and it's only been like a week. Like, yeah, we spent really we just spent one week on vacation. Yeah, she came back and did three, two or three paintings in one, two days. Oh, three paintings I'm in, in two days. This stuff is so relaxing. Yeah, and she's the calm. calmest I've ever seen her. She just be. It is. I be in a zone. I mean, me because I be painting them. It's me. All right, let's check it out. Let's have Nala be using the remote. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. How y'all gonna start off with an ad, man? Come on, black on business. Hey, come on. Okay, so you gotta spray a bunch of it to set the hair down. Yeah, baby. <coughs> okay. Oh, 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 shit. And then once you do that, your hands. And then we're going to go back into Natalie. What the? What is this? <laughs> 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 I'm pretty sure she got two bottles. Oh, I'll tell you how much I love her. They at the she wall. Yeah, wall yeah. Girl. I love late night Walmart. Oh, yeah. You look like we're in self mode. Oh, because we got the half on, the masks on, yeah, the whole sorry, nine. We got the mask on. You guys can't see our pretty little faces. Yeah, I know, but you know, what, what do you what do you want to do? Take them off. 
<laughs> live life on the edge. That's something I don't know. Alright, we're not around anybody, so we can take our mask off. So well, I'm not even breathing out of it. Two okay. masks, y'all. So Two masks. It cold out, so it's I cold know. Alright, so you want to put our mask up now? I guess we can put our mask up. Okay. Yeah, if we're going to be around people. Yes, I need a. I'm actually looking at What kind of mask is this that you have? Because you have this. Apparently, oh my your mouth a lot. I need that because my I think it's Kai Kai. Kai Dai Kai Dai shirt. No, good guy, guy. Anyway, look at him up rocking. I want to. I want to do the intro to the. Is that a? I can fix that up. I wonder. That's a TikTok beat. I saw on TikTok this girl reviving her braids with just some hairspray. She went around each one and kind of like retwisted it. And baby, we need to take these out. I can tell you that works, but then when she takes the braids out, I book your appointment or I'll see if I got time. Oh, it was bad. What is kind of like when people read to us, they have hair and they're locked, right? Yeah, but then now at the end of your braid, now you have a twist. Like, it's like matted in. Like, it's matted in. Well, it's not funny. I haven't been at Walmart. No, Sorry. Because, you know, I'm a little bit It looks cute, though. Oh, okay. Walmart got the deals. They got the deals, right? Okay, why you do that? Hey, you better go to Walmart and set up a pickup. You ain't never got to go in there. Okay, that's a little picture. Got the dog pads, you know what I'm saying? My boy is really, really, really house trained. You know what I'm saying? But sometimes there's those moments where I I don't let him out in time. You know what I'm saying? That's why you got these dog pads. You got to stay safe. See, while we're here, I might as well get them a little bone. They got some bones for my boy. Fun fact, I just found out that French Bulldogs are allergic to chicken. And I've been giving my French Bulldog chicken since he's been born. A lady at Petco or Pet Smart, I don't know which one it was, told me that. And yo, it kind of makes sense. First off, they are a rare breed. So they, they're man-made, you know what I'm saying, already. And then on top of it, he's a Merle. So that breed is man-made too. And then on top of it, it's like they got hella allergies and stuff like that. And I just found out he's like the chicken. And he has and he snores. He gonna start snoring. And I'm like, I wonder if that's it. So once I stopped giving him chicken, that that, that spot kind of cleared up. So now I gotta make sure my boy can't eat chicken. And even with these chewed toys and bones, I gotta make sure there's no chicken. You got some stuff? My brush. Got some, got some brushes? Okay. All right. Well, she's. See, we, we came in for one thing. And you leave with something else. All right, easy look like she ready to go home, go to sleep though. Yeah, easy, My rat call. They're struggling easy. <laughs> this is me in the store. See, I wouldn't really help you, but my hands are full over here. You good? Right. This is what happens when you're in a basket. You're like, I don't need a basket. I can't see you need a basket, baby. I ain't touching that basket. They can't understand you, baby. Her mask is falling. Let them know just say, I said, I don't know why. I just feel so excited about being at Walmart. It's been so long. It's been been so long. It's been all. Walmart trips are the best. It's always super loud at the end, of, like at the probably around this time because they're ready like to pack up and stuff like that. Super duper loud. Right. Get about it, little. They ready. Get the candles. Oh no. Gotta pass up the candles. All right, so we got everything that we didn't need. Uh, we definitely forgot the rat tail comb that I oh, came I here for. That. <laughs> that, please that tell probably me won't you go have no like, way. a comb. I think I, yeah, I have a comb. You have a comb? I have a comb, yeah. Okay. I don't know if it's a rat tail, but. We need a rat tail, Natalie. We don't because I told you I'm going to fix your hair. How are you going to fix it without the comb, baby? My fingers. Oh, my God. See? This is what happens. Do y'all go through this struggle when you go to the store buy everything except for what except you need? You for it. Wait, yes. They must have the self checkout because I don't have nothing bagged. I mean, it is too big to be bagged. We got here. Okay, first of all. Forgive me, I look crazy. So I had the most brilliant idea at Walmart, but I literally could not tell you guys. I have to like that in here. I couldn't tell you guys because I couldn't get the camera from easy, but okay, so y'all know how she said she wants me to do her hair, right? And I really right, did right. see a way to revive your braids with some just hairspray and me like basically twisting them on TikTok. But then I thought, Bro, what if I prank her and instead of using hairspray, I use this? Bro, I know y'all saw that girl that went freaking viral, viral who accidentally put it in her hair instead of hairspray and it was literally had her hair stiff and laid, honey, for literally like an entire month, okay? So I'm gonna put that in her hair right now. Um, <laughs> this is gonna be insane, y'all. She gonna really use it? 
I'm you sure she's not coming back. Yeah. She gonna use something else. So, so. She gonna she gonna prank us like she normally do. Yeah. She wanna prank us too. Cause... All right, baby. I know I'm using the hair, but are you still recording? Mm -hmm. Here, you record? All right. So, you oh, are we doing a hair tutorial? Is that what this video is gonna be? I, yeah. Okay. Okay, so I look toe up, Easy Gay. Toe uh, up from the flow up. All right, now, damn it. Shit, now, that net is not the hair braider. I'm the one that does our hair. You know what I'm saying? Now, actually, you did learn how to braid, baby. I, you did I learn how to braid. And I'm, you know, right neck and neck and too. You are, and you. First of all, I just want to say real quick. I've been trying to learn how to braid hair for over a year. Cornrow, she ain't consistently trying. Yeah, man, because it's not easy. She it's just said she's trying it. Last time process. she did it was like six months ago. That was six months ago. It was six months ago. Well, bring your little afro head over here. Don't worry about it. I don't actually, need it. Actually, you actually got really good. But I don't know. You don't know how to braid to the... See? The, you she don't know braid to the scalp. Well, the thing, the, the, the tutorial that I saw, you don't re-braid it. It's okay. like you use the rat tail comb, uh -huh. extra um, edge control. edge control, then you put hairspray, okay. you twist it a little bit, and then and it, does, it, it goes right down. It looks just like you got the gun. So you can get another one. Well, let me tell you, it's easy. You don't show your new girl. Don't, don't take this out. You have my car this a point to you. You better act real grateful. Lay me down. Give me the comb. Is that girl? Oh, yeah. oh, oh, you you want to talk crap about my comb so bad? You can't wait for them to see this, huh? Baby, I could have grabbed a new comb. You talk. See, look at this damn comb. <laughs> so what happened was what happened? when my hair was straight, uh -huh. I was trying to do the combing and the straightening technique. Oh my god! But I didn't know that you comb first and then put the Okay, right. so yeah. All right, easy gang. So I'm gonna start by putting her hair in. I don't know who it is. The real life tutorial. Ah, goddamn, but dang, dang. What? It's it's so awesome my granddad. Okay, so passing the wrap comb, and then if you don't mind, put a little bit of edge wax on the on the corner of the comb. Okay. Put your hand back. Put your hand back. Baby, stop. Ow. Tommy Peaches. Jeez. So there's already parts made for me, but I need to add some um, some edge wax around the braid. Oh, a little more edge wax. Be Not, generous. Wait, is this yo? Is this the baddies or the easy game? This, this is the easy game. They can, they can get a little hair tutorial. They get a little hair. What you don't think the easy game need to look good? Okay, it's looking fire already. I mean, not looking good as new, but looking good. You gotta slick it. Use the edges of the comb. You want to grab the rubber band? No, you don't need rubber band. Then uh, there might be a little extra you hair, no hair no, 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 to grow out because you know my baby got inches. <laughs> inches. So you do a little bit of, you know, wrapping the grow out, the hair growth the around new the braid. So once you set the first one, oh shoot, you know what? What I gotta do is spray all of the hair with the setting spray first and then start doing this because I add some tacking. Okay, so you gotta spray a bunch of it to set the hair down. Damn, baby! <laughs> Okay. And then once you do that, you just you're gonna have to like slick it down a little with your hands, and then we're gonna go back into Natalie. the front. What the? What is this? Ha! Huh? What? That's the hairspray. Baby, swear to. Is this the Gorilla Glue hairspray though? Cause they do have Gorilla Glue hairspray. Why would you put this in my hair? I saw it on TikTok. I Natalie, swear to God, you put this in my hair, bro. Why would you put this in my hair? I told you I saw how to do it on TikTok. No, you seen that, bro. I swear to God, bro. Swear to God, you put this in my hair. Oh, she did do the spray. How would you put this in my hair, Natalie? I told you I saw it on TikTok. Bro, you literally seen the girl put it in her hair. Why would you put this in my hair? Stop playing. Why are you playing with it? You put this in my hair? Yes. Bro. Just go rinse it real quick. Bro, why would you do that? Dude, I thought that. I, th I thought what? You thought what? I was trying you to thought give you what? a fresh style. Natalie, I freaking have black people hair, bro. My is going to, oh my That's God. That's why I needed to hold, you know, I needed to really slick it. What do you mean? Why would you do that? Why would you do that? I thought it was going to make it hold and last longer. Natalie, do I, why would you do that? Are you trying to prank me, bro? No. Why would you put it in my hair? Because you literally. Why would you do that? You literally told me, like. 
told you what. I love that picture. It lasts longer. It's so why would you want gorilla goo? It's it's gonna come out. Why would you do that, bro? Rinse it out. God, rinse it out. Bro, that's dramatic. Oh, she's bad. You prank me, and you, it's like that's not in there, right? Is no, girl, I would not do that to you. Is it a fake bottle or what? No, it's not a fake bottle. I put the um, I use this. Come here, look, I use this. <laughs> oh, she be getting easy, boy. Hi, 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 hi. Oh my god, aren't you? You better be just happy I didn't freaking put gorilla glue in your hair. Jeez, why are you playing right now? That's, that's like, fine. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. You it was a girl, fire babe. one. That's why it was fire. That's why it was supposed to be. You've literally seen a girl. It's supposed to give that impression. Yeah. No, she had to have surgery to get it yes, out. Yes, that's what I'm saying. I'm not trying to have no damn surgery, girl. <laughs> oh. Girl, I'll help you take your braids out. There is no reviving. Nah, this. literally my freaking hair is wet, bro. We're going to wash it anyway. Y'all press that. She got to wash it anyway. Oh, look at that. Oh, my hair. God. I'm being a party pooper. Oh. You, you know his life. Give her a kiss. Hard. Give her a kiss. I look crazy. Sign us out. Give her a kissy kiss. Easy gang, 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 gang. <gasps> oh, you gonna really be a party yeah, pooper? <laughs> now with Taco Bell's app. Talk about salty? How many salts is it? Because it's a lot of salt. Yeah, Jesus. That's hilarious. Oh, see, you saw him land salt. Surgery right now, like, bro, did you see that girl? <laughs> Wait, do you not know what's going through my Don't head? Don't ever play with a black woman's hair. Period. Period. Period, poo. <laughs> We're out. I look crazy. I look crazy, girl. Psycho. Bonnie's the game. Girls. Y'all, Easy was coming undone at the seams, yo. That was good. That was good. And I love the fact that Natalie can sit there and play so straight face. I don't know if I can sit there and play that straight face, but she does a really good job. Well, her oh. face, she gave everything away. Well, my face tells on me, but you, we've never been in a situation where I had to hold my face. I could do it if I had to, but I don't know. My... I could do it if I had to. Y'all, there was this one prank we did. It's archived. It's coming out. Stay tuned. Stay connected. Make sure you hit the post notification bell. Make sure you guys subscribe to this channel and the backup channel that we're gonna have in the description below. We did this one prank. She did it. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna never admit it. it was mine because I would never done it. She decided she wanted to prank Nalo. And if you guys watch the show Hot Ones, then you guys know on that YouTube, on YouTube, uh, the celebrities and people come on, they eat these wings. Well, she brought a kit of the different hot sauces. She decides to put the hottest, they're all hot, she put the hottest the one. Dab. The last dab. she put that on one on, one Nala's wings. chicken. We and were doing the try not to laugh. Wings, so she couldn't tell at all. It looked just like everything. So at this point, I'm like, I'm feeling like she had ate it already, you know, because she, she was almost done. She was over there, I mean, when she ate it, I feel like your face kind of gave it away that you did something. No, because when Nala was so much was, in the panic she that she didn't know. bite it, she just stopped like she froze. And somebody pressed she the button on her. She never even chewed it. She, she didn't even react. She just stopped. Like ah. she, did, she didn't blink. She didn't drop the chicken. She didn't do anything. I got scared for a second. I was like, did she? Did I? Did I break her? Like what just happened? Yeah, she. It was. It was wonderful. It yeah. was wonderful. But I, she didn't even get a bite. She bit it and tasted the juice of it, and so she didn't even bite it off. So it would have been funnier had she bit it off, but she didn't. Yeah, it was good. But I'm just saying, your face, like the faces you made. I got scared I because think... she froze. And I don't know if you did you see her freeze. Yeah, I was. It I was, was like, like the, everything stopped. On? Like somebody like pressed a button. Yeah, it was crazy, y'all. Like that. That's we should, really what we should. Did. Hey, subscribe to the channel right yeah, now. Yeah, you guys got to subscribe, video. comment, tell us it. where you're from, tell us what you think about this video. The more subscriptions, the more comments we get, likes, all that. We're gonna actually just throw that out there. We're gonna, I mean, instead of putting it in a certain order, I could just throw it out right now. Y'all, we have so much stuff. We've literally been recording since last December. And just like- That's not even when we started. Started happening. 
That's not when and we even we just started didn't though. Start uploading stuff, so we've been yeah. we have stuff for. We were doing a long before time. we even moved here. We were doing videos. No, we were yeah, doing yeah, couple, yeah, we yeah. were. But I mean, if I felt like Miami we kind of started kind of heavy, but yeah. Um, so well, yeah. every trip we went on, we've had a lot of footage when we traveled. Miami but, was strong, but remember yeah, we at, at the old house, we did the couples, the couple yeah. questions, and then we did. Um, oh, shoot yeah, the drink, that. never have See, I ever. I forgot about all that. So this stuff is old. So anyways, you guys, <laughs> tune in, subscribe, you know, follow us, turn on your post notifications for if you guys seriously, see these things. Seriously, Because we have so much stuff. It's just a matter of putting it out there. And then, you know, I guess editing it is hard. I don't know. She does it, so. Editing it takes a minute. You guys know. I mean, <laughs> you know, it's almost like you edit. It's almost like I want to be able to, like, hand off, like, yeah. three or four of them. And then I do like three or four of them just to get the content back to back. But can you get um, my pictures so they can see it? I know your bottom is interesting. Just shit. I ain't gonna draw. I mean, I got no pants on. I got no pants on. I'm chilling. But just scoot. Don't get your butt up. Just get your arms over. Come so on. let me tell y'all something. So if you guys, I'm not gonna give you the whole thing. You guys got to go back to our Valentine's Day um, surprise. The part one. The part two is coming out tomorrow. That was already done, but it just good to go out tomorrow and what I said at the beginning the gist of it is that like one day we decided we wanted to go and paint just have a day where we just paint at home well Ebony took it too far because now she's like the Picasso slash her mom her mom's also her a painter also. and all of a sudden she's so painting all guys, these crazy things it's it's I'm good it's beautiful but hands and I've been told this all my life I can do anything with my hands I can do anything you show me a hairstyle, I can do it. You say, hey, I started Nala's locks. I've been doing her locks, grew them down to this all ridiculousness. I cook, I paint, I- Do makeup, you said do that? Do makeup, I do everything. So it's the hands, they're magic. Stuff, jazz. So, yeah, it's the hands, jazz hands. So yeah, I started painting. Which one do you want to show me? Uh, the water one, what do you mean? This one or that one? This one. You got a lot of water paintings? I love. do, but you guys, let me tell you why. I'm more proud of this because the water, as much as I love water, which, oh my goodness, I love water so much. Water has been, turn it backwards. Yeah. Wait, whoa. Oh. Water has been, water oh. has been, you might not need to make sure it's right. Water has been, I'm put it down so they can see through the canvas. Silly. Um, you can see through can. Water has been the hardest thing for me to paint and capture. I'm like, this is crazy. As much as I love the water and the ocean and all these things, I can't paint it. So today I was like, since we've been back from our vacation, I'm like, okay, I'm going to tackle everything that's hard for me. That feels Not hard at sit the down time. And just do the easy stuff that I can do in like three minutes. But some of right. these paintings, I've literally done it like Some people can do like moon, sun, yeah. all that stuff. I can do some of the stuff, I can do it so quickly. It's, it's still fun, it's just not a challenge. So I sat down today to do this water painting. You guys. Oh, I wanna paint that. I'm so excited, that's beautiful. Uh, Head to the side. You gonna hit me? No, but you guys, look at this. Look at this underwater scene. Isn't that beautiful? All the textures. Oh, this makes me so happy. So I have this position where I can look at it. <laughs> I drew that. All right. did she that. did not. You see my signature on the bottom? That's that's all me all day. That's that is deep. Chef Ebb. Chef Ebb Rockins. Anyways, I'm excited about this. Yeah. So I, I will also encourage anybody. If you guys have a passion, don't put off your passion. Or, or skill. Anything. Or is it something? No, don't put it off. This is all I'm saying. So like if you wake up and you like to skateboard, skateboard. Make or if you to or, or, or if you want to like try to see if you actually like it. Okay. Well, first I'm talking about. If there is a passion that you actually have, because oftentimes as adults, we push our passions to the side for, for, for the sacrifice, right? Yeah. And you know, it's that's what, kind of what we're supposed to do. But I'm just saying, learn to incorporate what you love into what you do. Into your life. Mm -hmm. And then it will just become just something that you're just doing and you're fulfilling yourself every single day in a deeper way. That's yeah. beautiful. I could never do that, but it's beautiful. <laughs> um, but yeah. Do what you love every day. Fine. I don't care if it's five minutes, ten minutes, whatever. If that's bird watching, go watch birds. If it's sitting outside counting the blaze of grass, go sit outside counting the blaze of grass. Like, just make the time for yourself. That's all I'm saying. And this that right here, true. this little hour that I probably spend a day painting is like so good. So good. Yeah. So, yeah. I just wanted to share that with you guys. I mean, that's true as well. And if there's something you always wanted to do that you always wanted to just do for the first time, maybe something you want to make. Um, a habit or a new skill, um, I urge you, I suggest you, I 
I I beg you to fall into that. So what happened when we went to Miami? Um, and this is something, you know, of course, as people, we don't like to like talk about. I mean, some people do talk about like what they want to do, what they all want to do. And one thing I always wanted to do, because I love water, I am obsessed with the water. Um, I, I wanted to drive a boat. And so it was, I don't even know why it came to me the way it did, but I just caught it and I didn't fight it. And I, I went on YouTube and I looked up how to drive a boat and I watched maybe like 10 videos. Y'all, so I come out of the bathroom and she's like, we're going to rent a boat tomorrow. And I'm like, well, okay, cool. I'm thinking we're going to, you know, hire. We're going to get up. Like, yeah, hire somebody, right? And she's like, um, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to write, I'm going to look over, I'm going to steer. I'm going like, to charter. I'm going to charter. I can't think of the word. And I was like, oh. Okay. No, no, no. I think you said who's gonna, who's gonna, we're gonna get a captain who's gonna drive the boat, and she I said me. She got so I come out of the bathroom and she's sitting here watching YouTube videos on how to drive a boat, and it was crazy because the very next day we get there, I was not nervous at all. Like that's the thing for me. Yeah. If you feel confident in it, then I'm confident in you. Yeah. If somebody sits down to do your hair, their hands are shaking and they don't know what they do. You're gonna be like. <laughs> But they sit down and they're like, okay, good, we got this. They parting and doing right. Then you're like, cool, I'm in good hands. So yeah. the fact that she was as confident on the day of, I was good. Because, you know, I mean, that could have been interesting. But it was wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. And you know what? So the, the, I think I'm going to make just this one part a separate video because mm -hmm. it's a good concept. But what happened, Did you, do you remember what they said the deposit was yeah. to run a boat? How much did they say? You want me to tell her? Yeah, tell them. Yeah, it's fifteen hundred to rent out a boat. Yeah. Just, just the deposit. Just, just the deposit. <laughs> it's just the deposit to rent the boat. I, nobody tells you that. This yeah. is you can look at the FAQ, all that stuff. So I, I was able. First of all, what's the cost? If that's the deposit. Well, I was able to. The thing is, I was able to call, and I know how business works. Um, most of these businesses, you know, they have to pay extra charges for like using credit cards and stuff like that for people to use credit cards. So. I was talking down, talking him down cash prices, and he's just like, he was like, okay. And so then they do ask you, do you know how to drive the boat? Or um, they tell you when you rent a boat, some people offer the, the, the concept of like teaching you or giving you a license at the time, a temporary license or whatever. But he, when we got on the boat, he asked me all these questions and told me what to do, and I already knew. He was like, he was like, you done this before? I said no. And so I even got, I started like, he was telling me how to get out and turn around and I was doing it myself. He was like, what did he yeah, say? He said, he said, dang, yeah. you're going to have to work for me. He yeah, was like, I wasn't gonna... worried one bit. She I did was... everything. She probably, the only thing we couldn't do good was when we got to the private island, uh -huh. we couldn't um, anchor correctly. We were anchored to the Well, side. I was scared to anchor because, because of what they said. About not um, running the propeller jets on, into the on sand. On the sand. So everybody else was pulling in parking directly on this island, but they knew where to stop. So us being worried about what they said and you know yeah. whatever, she didn't I, want to I, go I too went, far. I'm tired of so we were out too far, but it was cool because one of the guys that was a captain on the other boat steered us right in, showed us how yeah. to do it, and then we parked it and anchored correctly. Yeah. But that yeah. was and when we the leave and when you leave, they push your boat yeah, out. Push you out. You got somebody. Well, if not, they have a stick. You can push your boat mm -hmm. out. It, but it was really. Nice. It was really fun, guys. I need you guys to subscribe. I know it. So you guys can that. see all these um, videos because it was so real. fascinating. I want you guys to be a part of that. It was one of the and best I got days. Some videos on the water. It was beautiful weather. Nala had so much fun. Now, what we didn't capture is when Nala fell out the boat. But don't worry about that. <laughs> don't worry about that. We were already that. pulling up to the island, so it was fine. It was literally four <laughs> feet of water. <laughs> Nala also was feeding the air. Feeding the air. I, I heard boom, 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 and legs. And then oh, she bro. fell, and then she laughed on the way up and on the way oh, down and back up. Fall at, right off here. The boat. Literally about she to was step trying to be fancy. Ladder. No, she she wanted to jump off the top of the front of the boat, and so I think <laughs> that knee slipped. Probably slipped because yeah. you know it's wet it's, up it's there wet. because you know the water's hitting back and stuff like but that. Yeah, it was, it was so, so fun. We passed by celebrity. What's it called? All celebrity celebrity lane. homes. It, we yeah. were on Celebrity Island. Celebrity Island. So yeah. you see all these homes, and I can't even remember people now, but it was like so DJ many people. Like DJ Khaled. Khaled and yeah. J-Lo's old home. Just regular, you know, mm -hmm. people that we all know and heard about, too, looking. Um, it was just beautiful. Yeah, it was just cool. It, and it was just one of those moments where I said, you know, I don't, I don't regret it. Or, you know, I never got nervous. I never got scared. It was just like, I'm, I was ready. I was determined to do it. And, you know, we all have that fear. But, you know, we only have, you know, with our brain, we only have one emotion at a time. So we have fear. We can't think about confidence at the same time. You have to have that one 
that sure emotion. And I just had to be, you know, confident to say, okay, I remember what I learned. I'm going to go for what I know. But the next time, I don't think yeah, I want to draw the boat. Had been nervous, I wouldn't have gone. I wouldn't have wanted to go. Oh. So if I had had an ounce that you weren't okay, I wouldn't. It would have not made me okay. That's, <laughs> we were gonna be gone for like two well, hours. That's well, a long time to be gone. And see, Nala was more nervous. Me. She was more because she didn't know what was going on. I was. It was a surprise. So she's seeing that I'm doing this she's and I'm all confident. Yeah, she's we're, like, we're taking off and they're you know un anchoring us and tying us up and you know talking to her and stuff. And I was looking like anybody else getting off, but that's no so man. She was like, wait a minute, what did you we're get it. lost? We're <laughs> it. So it was it was a good was time. Good. Um, can't wait to show that to you guys. Um, but yeah, we got all the way off of the other subject, which is fine. But um, we just encourage you guys follow to like passion. follow your passion, follow Do your something skills. New every day. You know, people talk about just um, doing uh, mastering your, mastering your weakness and okay. stuff like that. Because I'm saying people don't always know what their skills are. That's mm -hmm. why I say it differently. I say do what inspires you do what feels good because you yeah. may feel like it's not a skill or it's not a hobby or mm -hmm. it's not this because you're preparing it to somebody else's mm -hmm. truth is if it makes you happy then yeah. that's your thing yeah. doesn't matter like what everybody else's yeah. thing is everybody's and, yeah. thing is going to be different so that's, that's why true. i say just follow the thing that inspires you the most the thing that yeah. you wake up and you're excited to do that what day, connects you what makes you feel grounded looking, yeah looking forward to doing mm -hmm. it that's that thing that's the that's the skill that's the talent that's the hobby. Do that. Yeah. All right. So this is your favorite life and business coach, Reflection Deep. Chef Ebony Rocks. And we are out this piece. Ciao. Ciao. I know you're you don't know. even know how to spell calm. Spell calm. Calm? Mm-hmm. C-A-L-L? No. Calm? No. <laughs> Get out of my face. All right. Come on. Oh. I'm sorry. See how she do? We can't never just get it started. You know what I'm saying? Let's get it started. We're getting it started right now, but I'm going to just be me in the mess. You know, it is what it is. This damn camera crooked. Is it crooked? It's always crooked. I always say that. Your mom's crooked. What you crying, helper? I don't need all that. It's right there. You ain't even got to look for it. It's right there. Oh, I can't stop looking at you. You're so pretty. Thank you. You ready? No. You ready to go start doing hair? No, I just wiped off the purple shine. Hey y'all, this is Reflection Deep. Oh, and Chef Ebony Rock. I just think that's serious stuff. How I walk four miles today and I'm just sitting down? You ain't gonna walk no four miles. Yeah, I gotta stop and lie. No, I, I didn't walk that long. You did not. Why not? Why you hate me? I don't need all that.